Hi, I'm Brent Killens, a product manager at West Tech Industrial. Today, I want to talk about the essential safety features and requirements of sight glasses or gauge glasses for use on Section 1 boiler. These guidelines are important for ensuring safe and efficient boiler operation. Let's cover some key points. First, let's talk about visibility. The sight glass must provide a clear view of the full operating range of the water level within the boiler drum. This means that the visible range, at minimum, should include visibility extends past the high and low water alarm points on your system. The lowest visible point must be set two to three inches above the lowest permissible water level as indicated by the manufacturer. This visibility is crucial for monitoring the water level and ensuring the safe operation of your boiler. Next, we'll discover the four types of gauge that are available. Tubular, armored reflex, armored transparent, or bicolor, also known as a ported gauge. We'll discuss the benefits and drawbacks of each of them in a future session. When it comes to tubular or transparent gauges of more than one section, like the one pictured here, there's a code requirement that there must be a minimum of a one inch overlap between sections of the gauge. This is important because if the water level falls between two sections of a non-overlapping sight glass, it would be invisible, posing a serious safety risk. Water is clear, air is clear. If the water level is here, then it would be extremely difficult for an operator to quickly determine whether the gauge is full, over the high alarm, empty, below the low alarm, or operating perfectly fine in the middle of the range. The overlap ensures the water level remains visible across the entire range. For ported gauges, there's also a code-specific requirement. This is that an illuminator is required to meet compliance standards. The illuminator provides enhanced visibility by providing adequate lighting, allowing operators to clearly see the water level through the ports. Now, let's discuss a relatively commonly misapplied technology, magnetic level indicators. While these devices are useful for reading levels in vessels and are commonly used to replace glass-type gauges, in many applications, they are never allowed as a replacement for the direct reading gauge glass on a boiler. This is because they are not a direct reading transparent indicator and could falsely indicate water level due to changes in spirit of gravity or failure of the internal flow. However, they can be used as one of the code required remote level indicators in applications under 900 PSI. It's important to note that no controls or switches can be attached to the magnetic level indicator. In summary, maintaining proper visibility across the full operating range, ensuring an adequate overlap between sections of transparent gauges, using illuminators for ported gauges, and understanding the limitations of magnetic indicators are all critical for the safe operation of boilers under Section 1. By adhering to these guidelines, we can help ensure the safety and efficiency of our boiler systems. Thank you for your attention to these important points, and please remember to consult the latest ASME codes and standards for additional requirements and best practice. At West Tech, we are always available to help you with any challenges you may have, and we are happy to offer complimentary boiler survey service that will evaluate your current drum level indication and control devices to help you with your continued journey toward of operational safety and efficiency.